Welcome to the 100 level dark default death run. Now this was made by Fluffy Munda and it's basically an entire death run where you're in the dark. There's no flashlight involved, which is a little bit sad because the flashlight is a brand new item, but it's also a 100 level default death run and we love those over here on this channel. So uh, I'm excited. Of course, if you guys enjoy this video, definitely smash that like button and subscribe. I would highly appreciate that. We've been losing subscribers a lot recently. It's not, it's not a fun time. But anyways, without further ado, let's get started with level one. Very simple, very easy, as you would assume via a default death run. Pretty hot minute since I've played a straight up 100 level default death run. So um, this is, wow, I can just walk straight through all of that. And then this side, and we're good. Okay, moment of truth. Do we walk in and jump, or do we jump onto it? I think we jump onto it. <laughs> yep, you jump into it. I don't know why I just never do, like, I never do the right thing first. I'm literally a bot. And I'm sure you guys know that, and I'm pretty sure that's why you guys love me. I, aha. <laughs> Always check around, guys. Always check around. <laughs> there we go. And there we go. Oh, these are really cool items. I've never seen these before. Um, so you might be wondering to yourself, Justin, why are you wearing the thick visitor skin instead of your sparkle specialist skin? And the answer to that is very, very, very simple. Um, I was trolling around in BR earlier and I just forgot to change my skin. So we're unfortunately stuck with this skin for the majority and the entirety of this death run experience. So um, just make the most of it, enjoy a, a newer skin. I think it was just recently available to be unlocked like today or a couple days ago. So it's technically a new skin, which is always very exciting. It's just incre incredibly thick. There we go. What? Oh, this spawns here? Oh, I thought I just left an impulse here by accident like when I, when I It's time to focus up, I have died way too many times on this 100 level dark default death run and we can't be having that it's a default death run for a reason and it's our time to show you guys why we play death runs every single day of our life every every day we're not a bot or in fact we're better than bots impulse wall more like easy wall am i right <gasps> Why would it give me more than two impulses if you only need two to do it? I guess I should be just smarter, but whenever I get an impulse wall jump and it gives me impulses, I just assume that the amount of impulses it gives me is the amount that I should be using to complete the uh, the jump. And I don't even know how I died right there. There we go. Flawless. I'm guessing these this is a minefield right here. So be very, very cautious. Very, very scared. Slow and steady. Wins the race. Got it, perfect, let's go. No! <gasps> oh! Why would you do this to me? Why? I missed the checkpoint, no! Oh my goodness, you really can't make that up. I cannot believe that just happened to me. All right, so I guess we have to... So we have to combo it. I'm guessing hit the side, hit that, and we're good. Multiple cannons. Oh, okay, a, this is a way to reset the cannon if it gets in a really bad spot. I understand that. I believe, though, if I want to do this correctly, I should move this. Yo, this combo goes amazing with this skin. What in the world? Aim. Right there. I am just so high IQ, it actually hurts. My brain is so big that I get headaches every single day, which I actually do get headaches pretty much every single day. It's probably not because I'm really smart. It's probably an actual issue. I should probably go see someone about that, but whatever, we're playing death runs uh, and that's all that matters. Got it. And speaking of death runs, I know the default death run craze has been out for quite a long time, so I'm wondering, do you guys still enjoy the default death runs? Do you like watching them, is my question, I guess. Because I know a lot of people 
upload default death runs, myself included, I do them a, a fair bit. Not so much uh, as of recent, but I still do them whenever I see a good one. But I would love to know your thoughts because uh, at a certain point, the, uh, the default death runs kind of got so repetitive that they got really boring, in my opinion. And I would love to see and hear from you guys if you think the same. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm crazy. I have no idea. Oh, I thought that was going to kill me, but whatever. We good. We good. We good. We good. Oh, God. Make the jump. Drop. Oh, not a dropper. Hmm. I always die on these, but here we go. Well, okay. Call me Pro Hennis, because we out here. I'm literally pro I'm literally Henry. I'm literally pro Hennis. Alright, find your way. No the no death zones in floor. Are you kidding? Oh, okay, well. As we all know, whenever you're in a dark maze like this, you pull out your builds. It said no death zones. What I got clickbaited. Wait. Okay. Oh. Please? Oh, there we go. Oh, thank you. Oh my goodness. I hate mazes so much. You guys know. There we go. I guess I could use my map right there. I got it. Another three impulses. I don't think I need this many. Another three impulses and a pretty precise jump. I'm thinking maybe I can just impulse and walk off. Let's try it. That almost worked. Backwards. <laughs> I, I did it backwards. I was honestly not expecting that to work out, but hey, I'm just literally insane at death running, I guess. Is this, can I walk here? Nope. Okay, and then where do I go? Do I make that jump? No. Is it a Neo? It's a Neo in the dark. Oh, that's so weird. All right, just YOLO. Got that. He just walked in. I actually figured it out for the first time in my life. No left or right. I'm thinking it's a, it's a jump though, right? It was. Oh. I, I just had faith. I had faith. That's all that matters. And now we're pulling out our inner pro yet again. Got it. Got it. Oh, don't know. Find your way through. Find your way through. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay, got it. Oh, there we go. I literally forced my way through with my body. I have no idea what level we're at, by the way. What am I doing here? I'm super confused right now. But what am I supposed to hit? Oh. We're good. This seems like a super easy level. Got it. And now we're just tire bouncing our way to the door. Ooh. I will say this... Got it. I will say this dark death run has a lot of really, really, really cool levels. I'm a fan of this. Where am I going? Maybe around town? Yep, well, that's the way to go. It's like a weird jump Neo type of thing. Oh! Oh, okay, okay, okay. And then we hit that. And we hit that. Oh, thank you. Checkpoint. Okay, we got it. I did not see that there was a second. It was like basically one thin wall with two speed jump boost thingies right there. Okay. I think we're close to the end. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Ooh, that was that was smooth right there, and that was the opposite of smooth right there. There's poison traps. We know how to work these things. They're easy peasy, dude. Where do I go? Oh, this could be risky. If we fall and hit that bouncer right there, I don't really think we could manage to reset. That'd be impressive. Doesn't matter though. Hello. Well, this is easy. So I, I love doing those poison traps now. Got it. And we're taking a leap of faith. Don't go too far, don't go too far. Honestly, I had no idea where I was going. 
Where do I go? Oh, you just keep holding W. That would make a lot of sense. Oh, it hit me. I'm dead. Oh, and by the way, fun fact. When you guys are watching this, I no longer have my car. <laughs> it's actually at the dealership getting some work done because my check engine light came on recently. And that's never a good thing. Although, funny enough, the other day when I was driving, it turned off completely randomly. It wasn't my gas cap or anything for all those car enthusiasts out there. I don't really know what it was, and the dealership didn't really tell me what it was either. But regardless, I, I still think it's safer to get it checked out, leave it overnight, or whatever I need to do. And get that all... Get that all squared away. If you guys want to ever see pictures of my car, or just more pictures of my real life, or some battery out clips, go check out my Instagram. It is linked down below. I don't post on there too frequently. Yes! Oh! It's really gonna be a half block. Okay, so we have, to, we have to full send it and then instantly jump again. Yes! Just like that, baby. We freaking nailed it. All right, give me something a little bit harder here, Fluffy Munda. I guess we're going up. There we go. Stack the snowman. Ho, ho, ho. I've been a good boy, I think. Oh. You just don't jump. Okay. I was gonna say, this is like a weirdly hard default death run. And that might be because it's just all dark and it's kind of hard to see, which might, most likely is the case. But it's also, I'm just really stupid. But here we go. Shadow bombs. Which apparently aren't even working. Because I can see myself perfectly fine. <gasps> oh, that was so close. Oh my goodness. Jetpack again. I don't even know where I'm jetpacking to. Apparently up, though. Come on, get me in. Get me in. There. Oh, 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 where, where, where are we going? <laughs> Got him! Use is that, baby. Where are we going? Straight up again to the next checkpoint. We're good. And then I should probably get rid of the jetpack, right? Drop her down. We've, we've got to be close to the end. There's no way we're not close to the end. I... Make the jump! Come on! Okay, we're good. Falling down onto the green one. All, all left... Oh, okay, I thought we, were, we would die, that we're good. I'm guessing all the way right then. Yep. It's always nice when a level doesn't kill you. It's a pretty rare, but hey, I'll take him. Oh my goodness, that was close. Oh, oh. Whoa. Got that. Over we go. And do we have to jump? We're good. This is the same as before, where we're jumping up and backwards. Or are we jumping this way? Or are we? I have no idea where we're jumping. Whoa. Yes, just like that. So if you're wondering how I did that, you basically run to that very, very far left corner, far left bottom corner, and you hit space bar the second that you touch it. So you kind of go flying more towards this direction. A little bit cheeky, but hey, it's, it's a cool level. It's pretty original. Never seen that done before in Death Runs. And at this, oh. Okay, I was gonna just straight up try and jump it, but it's just a walk through, which are very easy. I, how did I die right there? A little bit confusing. I, I'm off-centered on my camera. I just now noticed that. Okay, I think we're fixed. I, I cannot believe this whole video has me off-centered and honestly kind of low the entire time. It's a little bit depressing. Whatever, we're good. Let's focus up here and finish off these last few levels strong. Because <gasps> that's the end right there. We're so close. We're literally so close. I wonder if I can just... Oh? Oh? Let's go! 98, 99. Oh, this is 99 right here. We have to just quickly make it. Mmm, not first trying it. Okay, this is fine, this is fine. There we go, level 100. We finally completed it. I hope you enjoyed playing the map. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Fluffy Munda, and follow them on Twitter, at Fluffy Munda. I will have their channel linked down below. And of course, make sure you use code Fluffy Munda or the code of the poor person you want. Apologies for my in inability to speak. If you want to use my code, it is Acidic Blitz. You guys know what it is. You've seen it in the description. You've seen it on the screen. Support me if you want to. It does reset every 14 days. So if you guys are actively using it, then make sure you check back on the top right in the item shop and make sure it's still there. But guys, that is it for the 100 level dark default death run. I'm not gonna lie, it was a lot harder than I originally thought it was going to be going into this map because it did say default death run. 
But I guess, like I was saying earlier, the dark aspect of it and everything being shrouded in the darkness, you're basically in the shadow realm, made it a lot more difficult than it would be if everything was bright and sunny and just heavens above. But hey, I enjoyed it. It was 100 levels of fun, a lot of original concepts, a lot of really good jumps in my opinion, and I hope you guys enjoyed as well. Of course, if you did, definitely smash that like button and subscribe. I would highly appreciate that. But without further ado, I will talk to you all later. Have a nice day, guys. Thank you all so much for watching, and peace out.